Welcome to the Brandon Coin YouTube channel and today I am doing my follow-up of 24 hours of mining Dogecoin. I flipped a majority of my farm over to it last night, 530 mega hash. That was doing about 55 to 65 dollars a day um, mining Ethereum through NiceHash. So um, I know I, you know, it was some people were like, oh, don't mind that. It could go to one cents tomorrow. This was more of a, an experimental endeavor. You know, we're just doing it for science. So, um, yeah, we flipped it over to Unminable, and I am mining on my Hive machines. So, let me bring up Hive real quick and show you guys what we're dealing with. So, I have 523 mega hash. Uh, I have. Six sixteen sixties, um, two thirty seventies, one thirty sixty Ti, and the last one has a mix of some sixteen sixties, some ten sixties, uh, ten seventy Ti, and a P one hundred six. So comes out to five hundred and thirty mega hash. And don't take into account those fir those first two payouts because that was done before I moved everything over there. So from everything or er, from. From this point forward is what I did in the last 24 hours. And let's go ahead and add that up. So we are looking at uh, 38.6 plus 36.6 plus 34.1 plus 36.2. And then we have a 17.4 waiting to be paid out. So I've in in 24 hours, give or take maybe 15 minutes, I have mined 162.9 Dogecoin and have been paid out actually almost all of them but 17 because it pays out every 30, um, and then it hits a payout cycle. So uh, if we take that and we look at the price of Dogecoin, let me get a let me get a hot refresh on this. Dogecoin is $33.70 or sorry. $33. Wow. Yeah, Dogecoin is 33 cents. So we'll go ahead and, and times that by 0.337. That comes out to $54.89 mining Ethereum and it auto paying out in Dogecoin. By the way, guys, GPUs don't mine Dogecoin anymore. So on Unminable, I am mining ETHash, which is Ethereum and it's paying me out in uh, dogecoin so that that's how that works now if we go over to what to mine let's compare if we were direct mining ethereum so let's go down to where's ethereum at there we go ethereum and we have 530 mega hash we'll calculate that and in a day we did 52 dollars and 49 cents and mining and getting paid out in dogecoin we did 54 dollars and 89 cents so 52 versus 54 dogecoin held pretty held pretty steady there so all of the doge that was mined was not obviously mined at yesterday's rate which was in the 26 range it actually was was pumping back up overnight so it was like as i was as it's going up i'm getting paid out less and less um some people, you know, I talked about it. I don't know if I'm going to do this for a full week or not. I figured I would revisit it at 24 hours, which I have done. We're still on pace with direct mining like Ethereum. Technically, I haven't really lost anything. I actually came out a smidge better. Very surprising. Um, obviously, all those profits and all that money could go down to, you know, a third of that if, if Doge falls down to like 10 cents or even less if it falls down to, you know, a penny or two. So this is all speculative at this point. Um, some people say that, you know, Doge is going to a dollar on 420. I mean, that is like ultimate meme-dom right there, you know. Meme coin, 420, dollar. It's just, I don't, I don't see it. I'm not advising it, but I got some. And I, dude, if, if, I'm just telling you right now, 162 coins is what I mined in the last 24 hours. If it goes to dollar, that means I mined $162 in the last in the last hour. That's just not no way, dude. That'd be sick, bro. Sick. Um, yeah. So uh, obviously, I, I don't want to get too many people hyped up about it because I don't want people 
FOMOing in. I feel like I'm already FOMOing in just by putting my rigs on it. I was thinking about it. Worst case scenario, if I lose everything that I mined for as long as I'm on Doge, um, worst case scenario, technically I only lost the electricity. And my average going, you know, my average power rate was right at about 280 a month. And that's with the full house. So if we divide that down, uh, $9 a day is what we burn in power here for our whole entire house. So maybe five of that might be my mining farm, probably a little bit less, honestly. But uh, so I might be losing five. Uh, worst case scenario, I'm losing $10 a day in electric, you know, throwing money at a gamble because 100% Doge is a gamble at this point. But you know what? We ain't got those paper hands. We're not selling at 34 cents, ladies and gentlemen. Diamond hands, diamond hands. By the way, this is not financial advice, and I don't suggest doing anything that you see on this channel. By the way, mega huge amount of spammers, scammers, and bots down below in my my comment section. I can't keep up, and YouTube won't let me like permanently ban these accounts. So they can just come back, and I can delete the accounts, remove them, hide them from my channel, um, you know, filter out their comments. They can just change it, and then they show back up. Do not reply to me if it's not highlighted. If it's not highlighted, it's not me. If you click on their account and it goes to a, a blank screen with a, a YouTube channel that says Brandon Coin but no content, that's not me. I'm not going to ask you to WhatsApp me and you know call me and stuff in the comments. I'm not going to be putting my phone number out in the comments either. Please don't fall for these scams, guys. Please don't, please. And there's other scams in there, you know, talking about some... Oh my God, have you heard of this? And it has like 30 comments underneath it. And I'm like, what are they talking about? It's all scams. So be very, very careful. And just remember if they're, if they, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Just, just be careful. All right. Thanks for watching guys. Short little update. By the way, I have a video coming up. It'll probably be in a couple hours. Um, we got some, uh, all the big trees down that I was waiting. My dad actually came over today. Shout out to pops. Thank you, dad. And he helped me cut down all the big trees. You know, we, you know, push it with the machine, cut it and cut them up. Got some logs, some good, good stuff, good stuff. So, uh, got a lot more work to go, but, um, you know, I figured I'll just update you along the way and videos coming. Thanks for watching guys. We'll see you on the next one. Peace. Uh, yeah all right so now that now that all the the new guys are gone um yeah how y'all doing did y'all see that jake jake paul and ben Askren fight that was a joke um homeboy homeboy ben he was built like me up there just just <laughs> he won't ready for no fight but yeah anyway yeah I don't know. I had something to tell y'all and I can't remember it now. Um, as always, drop a jellyfish down in the comments to confuse all the new people or first timers because nothing better than seeing somebody literally just comment jellyfish and then somebody comments underneath them like, what are you talking about? Mm. Oh, oh, by the way, I drank a Snapple today and Snapple fact of the day, 779. A group of jellyfish are called a smack. So, so if ever, if all y'all are jellyfish, and this is the jelly gang, it's the they the jelly gang gonna smack you. Get, smack get smacked. Smack a jellyfish. Smack a jelly. I don't know. It's too late. I need to go to bed. All right, guys. <laughs> Later.